What's up, everyone? I'm going again. Today I practice English by reading out loud on Vietnamese.vn. This is the topic: High school kids is manners on road. A 16-year-old school school girl driving an Electric bike was killed in a collision with a truck on March, March 14 in Dong Sai City, Bingfuk Province. Vietnam's roads are slowly getting safer, but not for kids, according to experts. Uh, to experts, high school students are the most likely among adolescents to be killed in traffic accidents due to their unsafe behavior on roads, found researchers from the Vietnamese German universities speaking at the workshop. On road accidents held yesterday in Ho Chi Minh City, Dr. Chick Tu Anh, head of Tô Đức Thắng University's planning department said as many as 2,000 adolescents, adolescents defined as 10 to 19 years old are killed on the roads per, day, per year. Students, students in high school grades 12 to through 10 to through 12 are the most susceptible adolescents in Vietnam with nearly 33 road deaths per 100,000 adolescents. A figure is five times higher than the average mortality rate of all ages in the country or eight to nine times higher than the rate of the same group in developed countries, according to Ang. The traffic accident rate is decreasing in Vietnam, but this is not the case for children. She said most of the accidents occurred when occurred occurred when students were driving mode bags bicycles or electric bicycles. Although traffic awareness campaigns had existed in Vietnam for years, the number of accidents related to adolescents remained high. More than 80% of accidents occurred when, uh, occurred when the adolescent was driving, she said. The five most dangerous driving behaviors of adolescents include changing the wrong land, 23.6%, going the wrong direction, 11%, speeding, 9%, 9%, overtaking other vehicles, 6.7%, Dangerous street crossings 6.2%. Motorbikes account for more than 90% of total motorized vehicles in Vietnam, the highest proportion of any Asian country. 70% of road accidents are related to motorbikes. The main causes include land violations speeding and going in the wrong direction, she said. New approach. Dr. Khuất Việt Hùng, Executive Vice Chairman of National Traffic Safety Committee, said the most common traffic violations were speeding, drug driving, driving in the wrong direction, driving in the wrong lane talking on the phone while driving and driving side by side. 
Vietnam is one of the top countries in the world in alcohol, in alcohol consumption, he said, adding that drunk driving is very common in the country. He also noted that drivers were assault, um, also un cooperative when dealing with traffic police. Traffic education and road safety are not official part of the education curriculum in Vietnam. Last year, more than 8,000 people were killed in road accidents. Traffic accidents causes losses of uh, 5 to 12 billion dollar US per year, while total damage from traffic accidents is expected to be 100, 100 no need, to be 130 billion for 20 uh, 2015 to 2013. To address this challenge, cooperation from the state, scientists, businesses, and local and international organizations in developing the new solutions to the traffic problem is very important, according to him. Vietnam has targeted reducing traffic accidents and deaths by 5 to 10 percent each year by 2021. Hung said, the law on road traffic should be amended and national database on traffic accidents be created. Wu Angton, director of Vietnamese German Transport Research Center at the Vietnamese German University, set a comprehensive plan for road safety solutions based on traffic data and evidence was needed. Road Safety Fund, Dr. An Ming Ngoc of the University of Transport and Communications said Vietnam lacked sufficient funds to develop road safety measures and solutions. For example, many agencies involved in road safety activities use the same funding sources. Other financial sources could include uh, surcharges on motor fuel, vehicle licensing fees, and road tolls. No set under Vietnam Belgium research framework with uh, a support of the National Traffic Safety Committee of Vietnam and Vietnam's Traffic Safety Association, a network of excellence on traffic safety for Vietnam was launched last year. Initial members include professors and experts from Hansel University in Belgium, Belgium and Vietnamese German University, Tôn Đức Thắng University, Ho Chi Minh City University of Transport and University of Transport and Communications in Vietnam. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.